We're gonna go fast. Let's see if the, uh... Let's see if the stream can keep up. It's a good wallpaper, right? Oh good. E-Force... E-Force experience is back. Freaking cantaloupe! Thanks for gifting out five subs. I had some cantaloupe for dinner. I had cauliflower linguine, some meatballs, and some cantaloupe. And then I made a coffee. You ever played this? Oh gosh. I wish I had something more civilized to show you. Because I'm going to be playing. This game is brutal. Uh, I'm, I'm also. It's hacked to widescreen, so some of the UI is going to be a little a little effed up. But once the. Uh, once the game starts. Oh Christ. I could try to do very hard story mode. I might be able to to beat chapter one, but it would just be grinding. Just grinding and grinding and grinding. At least this way, you get to hear different music. If I even finish the cup. Whatever. This is for academics. <sighs> All I have to do left is the story on very hard and also every cup on master class. Which requires a good deal of luck on top of just knowing every course inside and out and being bru brutally vicious to the AI. Some of the tracks in uh, Sonic Frontiers reminded me of the soundtrack of this game, which is top tier. Three, two, one, go. Oh Christ, all right. You typically want to like take out Red Gazelle or Black Bull in the first, first lap if you can, because it's a little more civilized before boost powers turn on. There you are, you son of a bitch. Ooh, uh, I don't think I got him. Oh no, wait, I got I got two skulls. Maybe. We might, we might have us a race here. Oh, oh, son of a bitch! You son of a bitch, you god son of a bitch! Oh, oh, they fucked me! Oh, they fucked me right away. Oh, I'm already dead. Ah, damn it. Crap. There's no reason to retry. Because you just... You lose a life, and then you're still on the first race. Uh... So yeah, that the machine selection screen's all fucked up. But. Uh, Christ. Had I done it? Had I done it? You what I used to do trying to clear some of these master cups if, is if I couldn't kill like Black Bull on the first lap of the first race, just quit. Quit and start over. Artesia Hecate, thank you for the sub. Because he's he's always up there. Huh? Nope. Uh. Your fire sting right? Nope. Shit. God damn. Well, there you are. Uh, oh! <laughs> Got ran before I could ram him.
Oh, Nimble, uh, I was having a really good time with Entropy Center. Really, really enjoying it. All right, 16th place. Basically boosting constantly. I made like two big mistakes. Interested in trying any more of the Ascent. Um, I've always wanted to go back to it, yeah. It's like exactly the kind of game I like. Yeah, it's kind of criminal that I haven't played through that game completely. That might be a good off-stream game. If I got a few hours, it's pretty simple to just put some time into it. Yeah, I'm definitely going to play more Frontiers. I enjoyed that game, darn it. God, crap! <laughs> Got the first place guy. Cars are flying off the track. Okay. That was much better. Let's see how the let's see how the ranking shook up. Okay, climbing up, climbing up. See, there's Black Bull. Look at him. Look at him. Number first place. He's gonna do better than me in virtually every race. Somehow I beat him in that one. But if I don't take him out of a race and see the okay, Queen Meteor, I think is the one that I was worried about. But if you can kill an AI in a race, they're DQ'd and they get no points for that entire race. So if you can finish every race and knock out like the top five, it's basically the only guaranteed way to get first place in the whole Grand Prix. Ah, oh, this one sucks. I wonder if this franchise will ever come back. I don't see why not. I just think there has to be a compelling case for it or somebody has to like give Nintendo some kind of dynamite pitch. Is Rockstar a suitable substitute for food? Oh, he's right there! Maybe for a little bit. Maybe for a few hours. Son of a bitch. Oh, you asshole. Come back. Man, I can kill his ass. Move, move, move. Let me through! it was worth it. It wasn't worth it. Energy.
Well, that didn't turn out so good. But I didn't die. Still in the top 10. I got a lot of murdering to do in the next couple of races. Ooh. I can do it though. So how's the stream? Is it pretty, pretty smooth? That's more what I'm concerned about. Like, I want that buttery 60 FPS. I played this game a fair bit, but I'm not actually familiar with the challenge you're doing. Why do you have to kill your rival? Because I need to have, I need to be number one in ranking points after the f end of the five races. If I can knock, if I can kill rivals, the car marked as rival is the car that's top in Grand Prix rankings at the current moment. So if I can kill five or six rivals in a given race, I've killed the like first through fifth. Uh, ah, like, oh God, stop it. <laughs> first through fifth cars. Uh, which means they get no points for that race. So if I get like 30, then they get, if, even if I get like 15th place, but I've killed all my rivals, then I still like have knocked them out and also made them more competitive with all the other crappy racers. Oh. Basically makes it way easier to climb the ranks because you remove their ability to get points for that entire race. Oh, Christ. did the spin attack right when I tried to side bash him. So it popped me off the track. I thought I was coming in for the kill and he reversed it on me. I did not know that that even happened. That if you tried to like side bash somebody, oh my gosh, that's a whole mechanic. I didn't know this game had. I don't use the spin attack very much because if you, if you like, if you do the side shift directly into the side of another car, it's a one hit kill, but it requires like precision. But uh, unlike the spin attack, you don't lose a lot of speed, and it's like a basically you, you usually only have one shot on cars like that. Uh, oh, I got bombed. Jesus Christ! Killing five people gives you an extra life? That's what that sound is? happens sometimes where I just like turn and instantly click into a drift and smack off the inside wall. You know, I got a lot of kills. It seems unlikely that I'm going to fucking catch up to anybody now. Oh, shit. Also, I think getting a kill gives you a tiny amount of, of energy back. Yeah, it does. It's enough to not die.
Uh. Uh. Oh, the middle of the course had an incline that made that interaction janky. Yeah, maybe. Ugh. Ugh. Still, still 10th, but yeah. So, like, I have 189 points. I can't even catch Black Bull now. I can't do it. Even if I kill him in the next race, he gets no points. And I get first, which is 100 points. I still won't get first. I still can't. Because I'll get 289 and he'll be at 315. So that's why you, you have to take him out of races to even make it possible to get first. This is a good track, though. Got a good, good, tr uh, good music. the song and get to have the song again oh yeah so lower left i think is lives so son of a bitch So tongue. This was produced by Toshiro Nagoshi, the guy who directed Yakuza. I think that's it. I think that's game over. Yep. Uh, yeah, this was actually the first team. This was the first game made by the, the team that became RGG. So this is, by, by all intents and purposes, the first Yakuza game. Um, that's how I tend to think about it. And you can kind of, like, that energy is definitely in the game's story mode cutscenes. Yeah, Super Monkey Ball. Yeah. The DNA's there. Because, man, the story mode is, is out there. Oh, Squirty Venus. Gonna be a good girl and go to sleep. Oh, I've had the flu for a week. You gotta go back to work? You shouldn't be going to work when you have the flu. Or if, I guess if you're just getting over it. Well, that sucks. But, uh, good luck. Sleep well. Thanks for watching. This is the same engine as Super Monkey Ball 2. It kind of makes sense. Super Monkey Ball 2 is a very fast game. This fucking track! Uh -huh. Two, one, go! You're getting twirled.
turns clean. That sucks. I gotta learn to drift. I, how does it drift in corner? Drifting is good because it just bleeds off speed real fast. Sometimes that's what you need. Ugh. Sometimes the goal is to just survive. Who did I get? Deep Claw? Damn it. I hope it was the other one. Oh, Queen Meteor didn't do that well. Black Bull didn't do that well. Red Gazelle, that's the one. Damn it. There's so many long, thin red ships. Red Gazelle is the mean one, though. That's the one you gotta take out. Red Gazelle and, uh, yeah, Black Bull, I remember being the, the real sons of bitches. Um, what's her name? Jody Summer? I think? She can be able, she can show up in the top three, too. Oh, did you see the video of the guy that got his truck jacked in the police chase? Or the police chase? Yeah. Yeah, we watched a lot of that stream live, which is a little scary. There we go. I didn't need to kill that guy. He was there. So really, he was asking for it. Oh! How did the car chase end? Uh, shockingly civilized. They just walked up to the car and arrested him. Like walked him to a cop car, a squad car. Ah. Come. was during a jump. That was my shot. I want to hang on to energy while nobody else is burning it. Oh. Mm. Oh no. Another advantage to getting hits in on AI racers is that they lose boost power. Yeah. I'm pretty sure they're smoking already. Yeah, I see the smoke. You can't boost anymore. I'm pretty sure they actually keep the AI pretty honest in this. In terms of, like, the speed that they can go and the amount of energy they have. Well, now they've got energy. Oh, that was the last... Damn! That was the last lap. I should have been boosting so much harder. I lost, like, four or five positions because I didn't, didn't think it was the last lap for some reason. Crap! Okay, well, could have been worse. If only I had killed them. They can absolutely boost and they have no energy left. Oh, really? So they get free boosts, but they stay at 1 HP? Is that is that kind of the trade-off? I know in story mode, they cheat like crazy. Okay. I didn't know if they I could keep boosting. 
I mean, well, yeah, no, I guess you're not allowed to boost if you're at 1 HP. You're allowed to boost down to 1 HP. Ugh, fuck. Wobbles. For some reason, my anti-gravity floating race car is weird about traction. Oh, come on. saw it. Damn it, I can't do anything. I catch him so bad, though. Ah. Is there much drifting in this game style? There can be. It depends on... There's like there's a there's a window in playing this game where drifting is a good idea, but then it just becomes snaking. Like there's a there's a physics bug sort of with drifting that you exploit to go infinitely fast. Well not infinitely, but really, really fast. I never really learned how to do that. I don't know, it didn't really appeal to me. That's like speedrun tech. I just kinda like playing the game. Wobbling. Dreaded wobbles. Expensive wobbles. God damn. Shit, they got stuck on it. Oh, oh. Jesus, ah, man. Mercury's like flipping into a drift and randomly bleeding off tons of speed.
play this on the GameCube and absolutely loved it? Oh yeah, me too. I don't know of anybody who played this game and, and didn't like it. Ah, oh, man. Okay. Okay. Still within striking distance, as long as there's not a 100 point gap between me and the first place. It's possible. I just have to kill like five racers and finish first. Easy. Easy. Has anyone ever seen an F-Zero AX machine in person? Yes, actually. There was an arcade in the Dallas area that had an F-Zero AX cabinet. And I would take my GameCube memory card there. Race my custom vehicle, put, on, put up times on the board. I just went there one afternoon and like swept the number one positions on all the time trials. It was nice too because uh, I was able to unlock the AX exclusive tracks. Which you can do through the game itself. You just have to, like, beat it. You have to beat everything on Master, I think. And then it'll unlock the AX Cup. Definitely shouldn't have done that. <laughs> we're good. Everything's fine. Last place, we're good. Oh. Yeah. Now just a leisurely drive to finish the race. Am I going to blow all my lives in the last race again? Uh, that's it. That's the only other life I have. Oh, yeah. You also have one life. <laughs> I got another one last time because I murdered so many people. But... Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh. That's it. That's it. Hey, gooses. Hello. Welcome, everybody. <sighs> I'm getting my ass kicked. I mostly, I was mostly just trying to test my encoder and doing it by playing the fastest racing game. Um, so I'm playing these cups on master difficulty and just getting wrecked. I haven't finished one yet. I really need to play safer on the last race because if you finish the, the Grand Prix, you at least get tickets. You can use that to unlock more stuff. Mm. Yes, we're enjoying the classics here. Hey, Docs 360 good to see you. I, I appreciated your comment on the Patreon post, by the way. I haven't read it all yet, but I will. Today, my reading was, uh, was medium posts. Get 
them boost pads. Zoom. Whoa! That happens sometimes. So I'm pretty sure what happened there is I checked that car. He died. His wreckage bounced off the opposite wall and then rocketed back into me with hypersonic force. Because when you kill a machine, they're like, they're bombed out. Machine carcasses still fly around. They like pinball around the, the track and they stay there. You can run into dead cars. Uh, so I think that's what happened. And then it bashed me against the wall and just stopped me cold. Yeah, you can also boost so hard that you sling yourself off the canister. Oh, I shouldn't be doing that. I saw a car that I really wanted to kill. Though. Yeah, the carcass vibe checked me. You have been vibe checked. You have been found. Haunting. Vibes are off. The vibes are fast. This track's pretty tricky because they like to hide boost pads all around the outer part of the oh, the outer part of the cylinder. So part of the expertise of this track is just knowing where they all are and rotating around and getting them all. all the free boosts. Free boosts in your area. No. Just took a walk and a back, and it's Lawrence and not Bruce. Am I too high? No, maybe I'm Bruce. Have you considered that I might be Bruce? I'm not Bruce. Bruce raided me while you were gone. But this one having good music. Did you do a little something else while you're out on your walk? Maybe. You spoof the doof? Spleef the queef? That's all right. Steph, Steph just bought us weed Thanksgiving gravy. I'm making that up. Sounds, sounds like a weed joke. Damn it, you son of a bitch! You, were, you twirled again! I love how their little portraits on the side spin around in a circle whenever they do a twirl attack, too. It's so stupid. I love it. Come here! Oh, fat ass. Fat car. Ugh. I want to blow him up so bad. Ugh. Freeze again. Smug bitch. Come here! Fuck. Shot. 
<gasps> what was I thinking? What was I thinking? Duh. Duh. Did you see they added that arcade racing game to a full console game. Oh, uh, are you talking about, I think it was Cruisin' Blast? The most recent one they released for console? I didn't play Cruisin' Blast. I do like cruising games, really. a little bit too much going a little bit too fast it's it's wild to me how lethal just the random point at which your traction brakes can be system you playing this on this is on dolphin emulator it's why it's widescreen and uh high resolution i mean you may not be able to see the high resolution because it's going so fast uh <laughs> i got these restroom i'll be right back all right let's get to that let's get to that story talked a little bit about how you can see the yakuza influence here enjoy enjoy story time You should write the second half of that post. Yeah, get started. Put the coffee on. Hey, Goose. Oh, the Modern Warfare 2 intros? The classic. I need to add a ton of, of Call of Duty cutscenes, I think. Wait. One more chance is all you get to win this F-Zero Grand Prix or you know the price of failure. Yes, yes, I can win it this time. I, I swear. To play the game. The only price of fame. <laughs> the only price of fame. That's the prologue. Very hard. 
This game's story on Very Hard is one of the hardest things in gaming. That's how I remember it. The precision and like what it asks of you is just so absurd. Damn you, Black Bull. Oh, Chili, 2001. Thanks for the sub. Okay, so we're Captain Falcon walking down the street. Oh, Docs, thanks for gifting us up. Ah, uh, my activity feed's busted again. Ah. Well, apologies if, uh, if people are out there supporting the stream and I'm not calling it out. I'll try my best to keep an eye on it, but I'm gonna have to pick up these pellets. This might take me many tries. The good news is the music's good. You have to get you have to like try to get a lot of those on one pass. Oh, I already fucked up because there's three. I can't get them all. Absolutely cannot. It's not easy to finish this on time, even if you're like doing it as a normal human being might. Oh, like I don't I'm not even gonna finish. I might just go back to Grand Prix. I don't know if I want to drill this over and over. Because I remember just being an out, just an outstandingly difficult trial and error. Uh, I, oh yeah, you, okay. You have to get two of those. Oh, I didn't do that right at all. Fucked it up. You probably want to take the inside track on the first lap because you want to take the longer path when you have the ability to boost, right? Why would you take the longer path when you're not allowed to go faster? That just seems more efficient, I guess. Oh, Doc's gifted seven subs while I was away. Oh my gosh. Well, thank you for letting me know. I'm, uh, I'm a bit miffed at Twitch for, uh, for breaking the feed again. Okay, I, re I manually refreshed. There it is. I see it now. Thank you very much, Docs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And gifting another one. Appreciate that. Oh, appreciate the generosity, Docs. Thank you very much. Uh, all right, I'm going to try this a couple more times. If I get to the point where I'm not improving, I think that's when I'll... Okay. Call it. Uh, probably should have gotten the pad there instead of... I can get all those.
Oh. Yeah, I did hit a wall pretty bad. Oh, thank you, Docs. Years of content and laughs. It's very much my pleasure to be a part of that. It's, uh, it's very cool. Hi. Ah! Oh. Ah. Oh you got Okay. I think it's possible to get those chunks that are arranged in a triangle all at once with some clever application of the shoulder buttons. Yeah, it is. Um, I'm just having to rediscover that. That like it's about your angle of approach and then also how you shift through the cluster. I'm having to reacquire. What do you mean like that? That whole diamond, like all four? Ah. I tried for both and ended up getting neither. I don't think I can afford to miss any of these. Oh, God. Wow. Okay. My timing is off. Oh, Velocity X. I don't think I ever played that. Sounds like my kind of game, though. I was I was big into Extreme G. Ah. It's the boxes of collecting up, collecting these like pellets are are interesting. They're further back on the screen than I keep thinking. Okay, I just need to use the shoulder buttons. I need to lean into the shoulder buttons way harder. Come on, fucked. Okay. I have to get, yeah, I have to get the side or the back. I, I did miss the back, I remember that now. Oh, Spicy Fappy. Thanks for using the command. Uh, I think that still works. Is sponsored by Cap the Capital One Shop app. Uh, oh God, Capital One Shopping app designed to save you money and win you fab fabulous prizes. Oh, I don't think that's gonna work. Uh, that's not gonna work. Well, that almost works. So there's like, yeah. Okay. Ah, I'm figuring it out. Thanks for gifting another sub, Docs. Yeah, there's um. I'm slowly remembering. Man, it's coming back so slowly. But yeah, there's like, there's... In the arrangements where there's like three across the track, you're not allowed to miss any of those because you'll never have a chance to pick them up again. I didn't pick it up! I keep... I use the Cap 1 app and combine it with Bing rebates. It's fantastic. Oh, cool. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, save money. The more installs we get, uh, and by downloading it, you're, automa uh -huh. you're automatically signed up to, uh, to enter. But the more installs there are, the better the prizes there are to give away. Going for a Steam Deck right now. We get a Steam Deck at 100 installs. I'll check where we're at in a second. It updates every hour, so... <laughs> We've through it! All right, I'm just going to go back to Grand Prix. I'm just going to go back to Grand Prix, because it's starting to consume me. I can feel it happening. Okay, I'm still at 50. That's fine. 
check it later. But yeah, take a look at it. Save some money. Use the power of Ganja. I don't know if that's going to help right now. That would help help me, I think, grind it out. To just sit back, relax, and just do it over and over. Got all the hards done, but not a single very hard. I'm, I know I can do it. Uh, it would just be about, I want to say, about an hour of me running that level over and over again, which I could do, but it's going to be the same song, the same like minute loop. It's fun for me. I think for the stream, maybe not so much. If maybe there's a, there's an actual like full F-Zero stream, I'd want to dedicate to grinding that out. Really should be hunting for oh oh mirror he's wiggling you slut I know I got somebody I don't know who I wanted though Edge I got knocked off the boost pad what's that all about Man. Ah, so fast. Ninth place. That was fairly clean. I mean, that actually line could be tightened way up, but still. Damn game. It really, like, it just, it super feels like Nintendo could. I wonder if it's music licensing, maybe. But why couldn't they just re-release this? It polishes up so well. This is on an emulator. Like, you could just sell this version, right? Well, maybe not. But they've done it before. Companies have done it before. Just packaged a game with an emulator, given it new cover art, and said, here it is, $10 or whatever. Ugh. Nintendo just... Too weird. Good company. Maybe it's, it's just not popular. I understand that. Like, I get it. Ooh. Some bumps and bops. Losing traction easier than I used to. Maybe I'm being a little jumpier with the stick. Sucked. Don't tell them to sell this stuff, it'd probably be $50. I'd be okay with that, but yeah. Yeah, does Nintendo really traffic in like sub $50 hardware anymore? A lot of companies just kind of gave up on that tier of game. Microsoft still does it for Game Pass, but I feel like Nintendo doesn't really make those games themselves anymore for Switch. They used to for 3DS. Sony doesn't for PlayStation Network. Hey, Docs, thanks for gifting another sub. You can use your energy more. You had like half left. Well, yeah, I mean, yes, 
but I've also died. I guess I've never died on the track. I've always just fallen off. So I haven't died to combat damage yet, but I've gotten close. And I don't have a whole lot of lives to play with, so I don't know. I think erring on the side of caution is... I, I haven't finished a Grand Prix yet. Let me say it like that. Uh. <laughs> I know I got smacked with the, uh, the carcass there, so... Definitely hoisted by my own petard. But yeah, I mean, when in retrospect, it's uh, quite possible to point out all the ways in which one plays inefficiently. Gotta, gotta make judgment calls. That's what makes games so good. Making unclear decisions. Oh, okay. Just throwing a question out there. Oh, okay, I see. My bad, I misinterpreted the tone. You're right, though. Yeah, you only have one life on Master Difficulty, so I'm allowed to die one time. Fall off the track, eliminated by an opponent. I've done a lot of falling off the track so far. But I'm getting the touch back. Uh, oh, no. It was a little bit off. I think it was a little off. though. Hanging in there. Ah. Thought I could catch him. Didn't quite. At least there were other anti-grab racers like Flash er Flash Out 3? I don't know Flash Out 3. But yes, there is Red Out. There's Red Out 2. There's um, a Pacer. Kind of a wi more Wipeout kind of game. How the fuck are you supposed to get first? Uh, there, there, were, there are ways to uh, be much faster than I am being. Uh, but also, you can also kill the other racers. So if you take an AI opponent out, they're disqualified from that race and they get no points. So it's possible to have another racer get above you every time, but as long as you take them out of one race, as long as you rank in every other race, you can get more points than them total. Also, you don't have to get first every time as long as like first through 10th rotates. If the same racers are constantly getting like top five, then it's very unlikely you'll be able to get first in the Grand Prix unless you knock them out of one or two races. Then suddenly, just getting steady like 7th and 8th place can actually get you to 1st in the Grand Prix. But it does require a fair amount of murder. You have to genuinely be very aggressive. And targeted aggression. You have to assassinate your, uh, your opposition to be able to reliably get 1st place in, uh, in Master. That's, that's been my experience. Oh yes, murder. You gotta, you gotta come at them with a wrench in the parking lot. That's how this shit is done. That's how, that's how winning is done. It's a bomb in the gas tank. Ah, Jesus. Ah. So yeah, I mean, if I were able to navigate situations like that a lot better. Crab foam. Gifting out 10 subs. Thank you very much, crab. Trying to give me crab power. The power of the crab. Come on. Few. I think, I think 
would crow about, though. Ah, jeez, I don't know how to handle that corner. That long corkscrew? Oh, no! Oh, I boosted so much. Fuck, what am I doing? messy right at the end. Oh, I just want to finish the Grand Prix now. Oh, goodness. Docs. Thanks for gifting 10 subs yourself. You guys are sub fighting now. I don't have that. Can't have that. Fighting in the gaming realm. Well, I guess the financial realm. Shouldn't. Okay. The good news is... Oh, Crab Foam back with 10. Crab Foam! You guys are going to make me play uh, Paul McCartney's Simply Having a Wonderful Christmas Time in a minute. Keep this up. This outrageous activity. It's going to be like me flicking the lights on and off. Ooh. I got him. I got the first place guy. <laughs> I just have to get like 20 more. Actually, I didn't even check the spread. They may not, they may not even work. There might be a, like a first place locked in already. It is possible to get to that status. But like you've, you've killed so many racers and done so well in the Grand Prix that you are locked in for first no matter what happens. Like there's more than 100 point spread between first and second place so then all you just have to do is finish it's a lovely but very rare oh what the heck why did my drift come out man fuck i thought that would work i guess you have to drift back the other way oh i am biffing this hard coming ahead there, but I tried to cut that last turn a little too heavy. <sighs> I mean, it, 
I was already so far behind in the Grand Prix, I didn't think anything was going to work around there. How'd I do? 23rd total. Yeah. When Rita had 346. But I finished. <laughs> I survived. I don't think you... Do you get to do F-Zero TV if you don't get first? One of the better features of this game, the defining feature, I'd say, is that when you finish a Grand Prix, you get an exciting episode of F-Zero TV where the hosts ask the racer one question. You get to choose the question. And there are three questions. Except... If you beat it on Master, you can ask the racer one special question that is only there if you beat it on Master. So if you want to get 100% completion, you would have to beat... Beat... You'd have to use every racer to beat a Grand Prix on Master to ask them the super secret question for every character. I got tickets. Yeah, Muscle Gorilla. Okay. Taco Knight, thanks for the sub. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna drill that stage again. A little bit. See if I can just maybe get a breakthrough here. Just an easy breakthrough. I'm not gonna be streaming for too much longer, just so y'all are aware. But, maybe I will. Maybe I'll get obsessed. Maybe I'll get it my first try. Ooh! Oh wait, no. Back. There we go. When are we re-hitting Silent Hill? Good question. I was thinking about that. I need to pick that back up again. I mean, I just, I want to play God of War Ragnarok until I'm dead. Well, not right now, because it's... I thought it'd be a shorter stream. I guess it kind of is. Three hours is kind of short for me. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! 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 oh. Gosh. I don't think that's gonna work out. Damn. I'll be hitting them wows. Finishing. I mean, I bonked a wall or two. I was boosting constantly. I think that's really what you have to do. Church, thanks for the sub. Doing the fine adjustments when you're boosting sucks ass. Yeah, so, okay, you just have to be boosting nonstop. There's really no other way around it. Roberta, I will channel... I need to channel fast. I'm not channeling fast. Oh my god, I weaved in between all of them. Ugh. I can't miss a boost pad. So wait, there's a there's a capsule next to a boost pad, though. I guess I just can't take that the first lap. Because the inability to boost keeps me at such a low speed.
see uh, J Mal J Mal Donaldo. J Mal Donaldo. Good night. Thank you for watching. I think I missed the capsule. I'm pretty sure I did. Maybe I need to just like only get the go at an angle. I maybe need to change my angle of attack here. I need to hit that boost pad. Maybe I need to be on the outside so I can hit the boost pad coming in the first time. Not allowed to do that. I think I can grab those three, though. I think. If the approach line is right and, like, I, I side shift at the right time. Finished that time. That feels better. Yeah, the music goes real hard, right? That's what makes this like more tolerable. Okay, I think I, I think I see what they're going for. I think I see it. It's like, it's just, they're basically painting out a few different angles on the corner in capsules. And uh, if you take that corner at those those three paths, basically, you'll get all the, shit, you'll get all the capsules. You just have to find out what those corners are. Or sorry, find, find what the, uh, what the various like lines are. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, I think it's fun. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna have to figure out how to do that without bonking into the wall. I think I think I needed to pick that one up. Maybe I get the outer stripe the first time. Yeah, if I can really tighten up how to do that, that last section. It's at the end of the track, though, so. Uh, I can't do that. That first pill, that first little capsule there is such a bait. Because you want to pick up as many on the first, on the first lap as you can. But you, re you really can't be dodging that a boost pad when you don't have the ability to boost yet. Hmm. God damn. 
damn, dude. I drifted through the whole thing and didn't pick it up. Too much longer. I hope I picked that up, that other one. No, I don't think I did. Yeah, it's aged really well, Dr. Duck. I agree. It's just a really fast, responsive game. And it's, uh, fun to be... Oh. I, see, I see a glowing thing. I drive towards it. I must get it. I'm wondering, like, hmm, going towards the center might actually be a more safe line here. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. I have to pick up one of these. Yeah, I have to pick up one of these and one of those. Okay, no, that, that's odd. I shouldn't be doing that. I need to look at that distribution of pills a little better. Hold on. I will... I'll actually just go and scout it this time. This is scouting, scouting lab. So, do this. Pick up these two. Get this boost pad. I feel like I'm going to go this way because I don't have the ability to boost yet. And that one's awkward to get. So, okay. No. Come through here. Pick up one of these two. Should have looked at that a lot more closely than I did. Let's see. You're going the wrong way. <laughs> There's kind of like two diagonal stripes that maybe I can go through for each lap. To the left. Kind of the same. It's like it's like a mini, or it's like a more complicated version of that at the end. Fuck. Which is dropping frames bad? Yeah. Oh, not for you. Yeah, I'm I'm concerned about that. That's a major reason I'm playing this game is to test the the butteriness of my encoder. Hey. Oh, yours is dropping as well, Chaim. Hmm. Oh, yours is fine. My bad. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I don't need to angle the car so much.
Oh, maybe it's worth it to slow down when there's a group. I can't... No, I don't think there's any tolerance for that. Maybe like a just tiny, tiny bit, but definitely not to like let off the gas or anything. Ah. Yeah, Sonic just said, no slowing down. I believe in Sonic. That was not three. Gosh darn. So it's like, it's best to come at it at a particular line that kind of takes you through both and then also do the, the side shift. Fuck, but like, man, you give it too much. You're just bouncing off the wall, and then you're you're a host. Oh, uh, tricked. Absolutely tricked. Three, two, one, go. <sighs> doing man Three, two, Oh no, maybe it is worth slowing down for some of them. I missing that boost pad may actually cost me this though. Ah. Uh. Okay, I'm under. Okay, I'm seeing why that's so awkward now. Getting that one on the inside, really, really, really. This your angle for everything else. So you kind of have you kind of waste an entire lap just picking up that one. Just hearing about inside games. What? The hit show? The hit gaming news show? Yeah, we're back. Inside gaming is back, except it's inside games now. The only time the bitrate isn't in the gutter along with the camera, the beginning of the race and lore videos. During most of the races, the frames drop, the camera's just pixels. I'm watching a PS4 app. Does, does that have like a, a quality setting? Or is it just on an automatic? Uh, Roberta, thanks for the sub, by the way. And Docs, thanks for gifting another sub to Spicy Fappy. Legally distinct. So this, this game, oh, I, I nope, I got the, the two wrong ones. You have to get like, uh, you have to get one of the middle ones. Okay. So, okay. Blurry is fine. Is it chopping up? Is it, is it stopping? Are you, are you, are you seeing the frames stop? Is it hitching up? Frame rate is sublime. Okay, all right. Just blurry, all right. Blurry, blurry is expected. I can't do anything about blurry. Okay, that's the only thing I was super curious about. It'll look, as long as it looks like smooth blurry mess. But if it's choppy blurry mess, then that's bad. This is so hard to do while looking at chat. <laughs> but thank you, it's good to know. Okay. Ah, I didn't pick up the one I needed. It's 
it's like you have to you have to kind of be angled into it and then you hold the trigger to move into it and then you have to turn away from it nearly immediately so that you don't bonk the wall ah hideous Been out. Man. Have you come from the right on the first group of three? Like from here? Wait, hold on. I mean, from there? What, or do you mean at the end of the track? I picked them all up and then I bonked off the wall again. It should have, it should have at least been three. Somehow I missed another one. photo to show the bitrate on your end yeah no yeah that's it's gonna look like that huh <sighs> it's gonna look like that um again my my main concern is the smoothness of it as long as it uh as long as it doesn't look choppy fuck god i don't remember these capsules being so small uh, I should hang it up. I should hang it up. It's getting, it's getting late. <laughs> so jittery, this stupid car. Seems like it wouldn't be, but all of a sudden, jitters. Yeah, you're right. You're right. It's not going anywhere. What the heck was that? Okay. Last try. Probably. One of them. How did I do that?
my I think my analog stick might be a little sticky. Like it feels like it's taking a little too much force to move the stick away from center, so that when it does it like goes boop and then the car like keeps wiggling. Anyway. Uh, Alright, that'll do it for me tonight. Hey, thank you all very much for watching. If you rated over from Bruce's stream, thanks for sticking around. Uh, before I go, let me thank the sponsor of the stream for this month. Capital One! Okay, got a few more installs. Good stuff. Good stuff. But hey, if you wanna if you wanna save some money and also jack up the freebies that it, uh, I get to give away to stream, check it out. Use the giveaway command. It's a free add-on for your browser that'll save you money. And it'll enter you to win fabulous prizes like a Steam Deck or a 3080 Ti. Yes! So thank you, Capital One. And thank you for checking it out. And thank you for being great. Thank you for gaming. Always gaming. Have a good night, everybody. I'll be back tomorrow. And I will be playing probably God of War. Tomorrow's also MediaTek block. So I think, I think I might be attending another birthday. But uh, apart from that... There'll be gaming, and then there'll be random clips for your Friday evening to start your weekend. Good background noise for your gaming, your grinding, or your partying, your studying. No one does that on a Friday. Anyway, have a good night, everybody. Thanks for watching again. Catch you next time.